Backing up your Mac to your NAS is important because it keeps your files safe and accessible in case of any unexpected event. The Apple OS X system distributes a backup software application called Time Machine, which creates backups of files that can be restored at a later date. Because the NAS is network-based, your Time Machine backups are backed up through the network so there aren't any connected devices, like your conventional external disks or drives. Meaning in a studio environment, everyone with the Mac can all backup to the NAS without the physical connectivity, making it easy, convenient, and efficient to backup live workstations and restore previous backups. In this video, you will learn how to backup your Mac to the NAS. The NAS supports Time Machine for Mac OS X 10.5 or later for users to concurrently backup multiple Macs. By enabling this, the up-to-date stored files and settings on your Mac can automatically be backed up to your NAS or recovered at any time. First, you should log into your NAS with your username and user credentials. Go to Backup Station, then open up the Backup Server section. Select Time Machine, then enable it. Enter a password for the Time Machine user, which is empty by default. Select a disk volume from the drop-down menu if you have more than one volume. The data from the Mac will be saved on the selected volume of the NAS. Then enter the capacity to allow the Time Machine users to use for backup. This number must be smaller than the available space. I leave it blank since zero means there's no capacity limit for our Time Machine backups. Click Apply to save your settings. You can also check or delete your past backups by using the Manage Backup tab. Time Machine is now enabled on your NAS and you should begin using the Time Machine Backup on your NAS by going to System Preferences, then opening the application. Click Select Disk, then select TM Backup on your NAS to use it for backup. If you are unable to find the disk, make sure that your Mac and the NAS are on the same network and that both have wired network connections. Enter the username Time Machine and the password you made to access the NAS. Then click Connect. Upon successful connection, the Time Machine on your Mac is switched to ON. The available space for backup will be shown and the next backup will start in 2 minutes. Keep in mind that your first backup may take a long time depending on how many files you have. However, Time Machine backs up only the files that have changed since the previous backup, meaning that future backups will be a lot faster. Now, you'll know how to automatically back up your back data to the NAS by using Time Machine. If you want to learn about restoring your Mac through Time Machine, you can refer to QMP215 as a guide. Thank you for watching and be sure to check out some of our other videos. Bye!